New at noon, Cafe Reconcile receives its largest donation in history worth several million dollars. The money will go towards youth workforce development programs. WDSU reporter Anam Siddiqui is highlighting the nonprofit's transformative work over the years. For years, Cafe Reconcile has been admired nationally for their work to put young people on the right path. Now, leaders say with this $4 million donation, it really expands their commitment. Anybody receiving a call about a donation of $4 million, it's just amazing. And so first, I just had to calm down. Um, it was so exciting. We've worked really hard over the last six years to be able to grow um, the organization. Cafe Reconcile program prepares 16 to 24 years old for the workforce. In 14 weeks, young people are paired with mentors, earn industry credentials, and experience on-the-job training at the cafe. The goal, to change the narrative and address educational and employment barriers. Appreciating the restaurant's advocacy, philanthropist Mackenzie Scott is donating $4 million, the largest donation in the nonprofit's history. CEO Carrie Billy says this gift was made possible thanks to the community support and it will amplify their work. The city of New Orleans are constantly changing and evolving. So for us, it is always centering young people. It's an intern-centered space. It's a people, community, and city. And so for us, we see this gift as um, support of our work of deepening what we do for young people and what's to come for them in the near future. The nonprofit accepts applications all year long, serving around 120 young people. For anyone interested, there will be an open house on March 19th at 3.30 at the cafe. Reporting in New Orleans, Adam Siddiqui, WDSU News.